Georgia, apartment complex. A man facing eviction made arrangements with the leasing office to peacefully vacate the premises before the official eviction date. He even had a friend retrieve his belongings while he worked out of town. However, when the friend arrived, he discovered the locks had been changed, and he couldn't enter the apartment. The next day, the manager unlocked the apartment for the friend, revealing a shocking sight. The place was completely empty. The friend promptly FaceTimed the victim, who then contacted a neighbor with a ring doorbell camera. The doorbell footage provided crucial evidence. It clearly showed three individuals entering the apartment and leaving with the victim's belongings. The victim, armed with this video, contacted the police. The officer who responded quickly identified the culprits, three members of the apartment's maintenance crew. Upon investigation, the officer discovered a troubling pattern. Identified the culprits, three members of the apartment's maintenance crew. Upon investigation, the officer discovered a troubling pattern. So that was the moving out to bed? They move out to bed? Hold the apartments. The officer who responded quickly identified the culprits, three members of the apartment's maintenance crew. Upon investigation, the officer- They moving out beds? They getting crazy. The, video the first suspect admitted to taking the sofa it. and bed, claiming a misunderstanding with the manager. He believed the eviction had already happened and offered to return the items. Yes, sir. Is How you doing? Manager? No, she's uh, down there locking up the unit. Are oh, you okay. David? Yes, I did. All right, perfect. I'm Officer Black, How you doing, City of Shambly. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. Um, before we go any further, I'm going to read you something, okay? Everybody seen it on TV. Everybody probably knows it, but I got to read it to you, okay? What's this before you read it to me? This is your Miranda warning. Let me, let me just explain myself. No, what you told her was? Uh, it was just a miscommunication, not on my part. Okay. I was told wrong information. I got you, but before we dive into that, let okay. me read this to you, okay? You have the right to remain silent. Anything you say can and will be used against you in a court of law. You have the right to speak to an attorney and to have an attorney present during any questioning. If you cannot afford an attorney, one will be provided for you at government expense. Knowing and understanding your rights as I have, as I have explained them to you, are you willing to answer any questions without an attorney present? No. I can't. Okay, so that's a yes? Sure All right, so you said there was some miscommunication yes. going on? Yes. Tell me about that. Okay. What's the miscommunication? I don't, I'm not, I don't want to throw nobody under the bus. That's fine. But I'm just uh, a follower of many things, but we got the message that it was going to be an eviction. Okay, so he, he, he basically, okay, okay, he's a snitch. He's a snitch. He's a snitch. For today, I was okay. told to go ahead by my supervisor, Sammy. Let's go get it, take it out, and hurry up before it hit the curb, so. I knew she was in on it. I knew she was in on it. I said that lady was in on it. I said an eviction for today. I okay. was told to go ahead by my supervisor, Sammy. Let's go get it, take it out, and hurry I up. I told y'all, Chad, I don't, I don't care. So, here, okay. tell me what I can get. Everybody got stuff, not just me. But okay. I have the stuff, if you want it back, or if you want to sell it to me. We can do something, but okay. if you want it back, I'll give it back. No I problem. got you. And does Sammy work on site here too, or is he off yes, site? Yes, he's at the pool right now. Okay. But yeah. And All right. Javar, making both maintenance tests, but me and Sammy went up there. I broke the sofa down. I got it in my crib. I live on property, but I just don't want him to know where I live. I got but you. But I got you. Just well, that's what we're doing. That's what we're doing. Okay. But I'm not a thief. You know, I work here. I just didn't good furniture, good, good stuff. And you were told it was going to be an eviction? Yes. And so before it hit the curve... So they're going to leave a TV in there? All the for Monday. We went in there Friday. So I got gotcha. my brother. He got a truck. Me and my 13-year-old son. We moved everything from across. I stay in this building right here between me and you. But yeah, yeah, yeah. So that's where it went. So okay. I didn't know it was going to be an issue. I got you. I got you. I got you. Miscommunication. Yeah, and I was going to talk to them, my man, but... He was right here. I yeah, nah, nah, you did, nah, nah, you did the right thing. You did the right thing. You have your ID on you by yes, chance? Yes, I do. This is, this is bad, man. Okay. Well, in a sense, I'm going to tell you it is. I know. And the reason why, and I'm, I, I'm just a straight shooter. Like, I, I, I don't like to soften blows. I like people to just know what's Please. going on. Um, the reason why it's bad is because he was coming to get his stuff. 
came to pick up his stuff on Saturday, and everything's gone. Um, and so you imagine, you know, it's, it's like right, you. You right. come home, right? And somebody went and took your stuff. Um, I just got the bedroom set and the soap. Okay. It's not like he ain't know those for real though. Uh, my son like a photograph, a positive. You're black. You're motivated. Oh, no. yeah, that type. So you said bedroom set and sofa. And sofa. Does the bedroom set include the um, nightstands? Yes. Okay. And that's all I grab. Headboard, mattress, box spring, rails, two nightstands. Okay. Um. Like I said, I just know how to be blunt. Yeah, right now, it's, it's burglary. Right, but we all um, grab. We all grab. Oh no, we got video. Look at him, look at him. I told you he was a certified snitch right off the gate when he said that I'm just a follower. Off the, off the I'm just a follower, off the I'm just a follower, I knew he was a snitch. I'm just a follower. Okay, I knew every sentence that's going to come out of your mouth is 100% true. It's because you're a snitch. I mean, I, I, it wasn't just me. Okay. We got video. Okay. So everybody, everybody face on it. Clear as day. Locks showing, swinging, and everything. Locks so, showing, swinging. <laughs> yeah. It, it's it's made this team. Messed up. Everybody. I'm not surprised. Um, they gotta get a whole new so main team. That, that piece of information, because I'm a, again, I'm just a straight shooter. So I'm gonna tell I'm you. A straight shooter too. If, if she would have, I would have talked to her. I would told her. I don't lie. So so my job. And if it's jumping, with, with this piece of information, right? It changes some things. Um, because it changes some things with the aspect of orders and who was given. Because without this information, with, you know, saying, hey, we got the eviction notices, we will clean them out, whatever, um, all three of y'all were going to get a warrant. It was gonna be just straight, straight like that. And then I was gonna come back here later today with a van, and everybody gonna get in a van, and everybody gonna to go to DeKalb County. I'm just, it, I'm just being honest with you. Um, but that piece of information, it changes some stuff. No, we wanna see. So now I need to go talk to. You said no, Sammy no, is a supervisor. Yes, I'm joking. And he's by the pool right now. What does Sammy look like? He's red hair swinging. Black <laughs> male like, or uh, uh, slim guy. With um, locks. With locks. Oh, okay. He the one with locks. Yeah. Who lives here? Bar one pick. Oh, there they so, go. Yeah. You see him? Uh huh. So he talked to the manager first and told her what he told her. I just told her, I just said, I don't know. I'm good, man. I'm, I'm older than everybody out here. I'm 23. I'm like, I don't got time. I got family, man. Look. Are they doing maintenance on the pool right now or? He probably trying to stay out of dodge, man. I'm probably gonna be fall guy, but I ain't trying to be. But nah, yeah, I, I don't. I don't do fall. I don't I, do I, fall I can't guys. Go for this, man. I don't do fall guys. I do the whole team, or I do the one that right. I got yeah, the best case on. I'm just telling you straight up. The one in the league, he's by the door. That's, that's, yep, that's I'm gonna go talk with him. I ain't no move without no permission. That's all I'm saying. But I gotta talk with me. I appreciate it. I really uh, do. I apologize. Like I said, it changes some things. Thank you. Mm -hmm. The second suspect, the crew supervisor, denied taking anything but trash. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Messed up everything. Going to jail. The whole team. We're not going. I'm doing all right, you. Is your name Sammy? It is. What Can we talk? Here? You mind talking with me? Yes, sir. All right. I'm going to yeah. read you something, too, like I read everybody else. But you read me first. Give Miranda warnings. And then we'll, we'll go from there. You have the right to remain silent. Anything you say can and will be used against you in a court of law. You have the right to speak to an attorney and to have an attorney present during any questioning. If you cannot afford an attorney, one will be provided for you at government expense. Knowing and understanding your rights as I have explained them to you, are you willing to answer any questions without an attorney present? So okay. All right. So, like I told everybody else, man, I'm just a straight shooter. I'm gonna just tell you how it is. Uh -huh. Okay. We have a tenant here uh -huh. that was, I guess, put on an eviction list. He's supposed to be getting evicted. Uh -huh. Um. 
He was told by property management that he'll have the weekend to retrieve his property from out the apartment. Okay. Over the course of the weekend, you and some other employees were seen entering him into his unit and grabbing his belongings. So, uh huh. I didn't grab anything out of the unit as far as his belongings, but it was trash. We got you on other video proof, that, buddy. I did not take anything. Out okay. Of the what, was trash, trash, what was trash? Trash as far as like the, the perishable, the, the food TVs, that he left out uh -huh. that was just sitting right there. That was it. But okay. besides that, okay. Was there an eviction notice or? It was yeah. a so. I was off for a couple of days last week. Okay. So when I got back that Friday, um, received a message, went up there, peeped my head in, bugs, gnats, et cetera, trash. I don't touch stuff when it comes to eviction, like their personal property. Okay. But no, sir, I didn't do that. Okay. Now, again, I state, all I had took out was some trash. Besides that, I don't have any of this stuff. Any of his belongings at all. Okay. Is it normal to go in apartments when there's an eviction notice coming out? Like to so, peek your head in? So, yes, it's normal for me to walk the units. Okay. But far as like just going into the units, like, nah, but trash wise, far as refrigerators, yeah. stoves, appliances, stuff like that, yes. But besides that, no, sir. Okay. All right. Um, what did you tell anybody else that they can go I like, give permission to go into the unit and oh, no, sir. take belongings or anything like that? No, sir. Why would I do that? Okay. I, people uh, do different things, man. I, no, I don't sir. try to understand the human mind. Um, Touche. But definitely, no. Do you know if anybody else went into the unit and grabbed so, items? From what was told to me. Okay. It was happening at 11 o'clock at night or whatever time of Whatever it was, mm -hmm. but as far as me physically seeing anybody, no sir, I didn't. So I can't say we got hey, him on video I too? seen X, Y, and Z Yo, because wait, I didn't see video? it. Do you have your ID on you? Yeah, I do. Chance? Perfect. And then you said all you took was trash out there. That's trash. Perishable. Perishables. Nothing. Worth the value. Nothing worth value. Because you had anything. gnats and bugs and stuff yeah, like that. Yeah, nothing worth side. value. It wasn't. Look at me. Like it wasn't nothing. I it wasn't you. nothing. In there. Just to confirm, you didn't tell anybody else. No sir. Y'all can go in the room and no, or the apartment and no, sir. have at it. No sir. All right. So, like I've been telling everybody else, right now, is being investigated as a burglary case. Okay? Mm -hmm. um, because even if they sent out an eviction saying, or a letter saying, hey, we're going to start the eviction process on these units, mm -hmm. you still got to go through the process before belongings get transferred out the, right. the unit. Right. Um, when you start the process, that's when you can change the locks. Right. Deny them access or right. unsupervised access. They, 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 um, yeah. And so. Yeah, you know, it's, it's like anybody, man. You come home and all your shit gone, you'd be upset. Yeah. And so that's that's oh, no. that's what is that's what it is right now. Right. As um, it should be. So, I'm just trying to piece some stuff together. Right, but that's 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 mind boggling. So some another adult could say, I said, hey, go have it. Like, no. That I'm don't not even, saying that. I'm just. I was told you were the supervisor. I, I am. But so, at the same time. I got a lot hanging over my head just because of the how title. I look. Yes, and the title. You. So, yeah, no. Nah. Right. Sir, would you mind talking with me? Sure. All right, cool. I'm going to read you something. I read it to Sammy. I read it to everybody. Let's protect you and make sure I'm doing my job correctly. Yes, All right, it's just your, it's your Miranda warnings. Have you ever seen any kind of cop show, TV show? You know it, you've heard it, but I got to read it all the way through, okay? Right. You have the right to remain silent. Anything you say can and will be used against you in a court of law. You have the right to speak to an attorney and to have an attorney present during any questioning. If you cannot afford an attorney, one will be provided for you at government expense. Knowing and understanding your rights, as I have explained you them to you, the, are you willing to answer any questions without an attorney present? You gotta pay for the free lawyer? Yeah, I'm good. Appreciate you good? it. Yeah, sure, why not? Okay, perfect. So, 
I'm not. I don't like to assume anything, so I'm gonna just tell you why. I'm yeah, even step over here and shave, man. Yeah, it's a little hot, man. I appreciate yeah. that. Yeah, come over here. The third suspect, despite being caught on camera carrying a TV, insisted he only changed the locks and checked the unit's condition. Oh my God, she lying. So, what I'm investigating right now is essentially a burglary, right? Yes, sir. Certain things have come to light during the course of me asking people what happened. But the original complaint is a gentleman was called, said, hey, we're going to start the eviction process, mm -hmm. but we'll allow you to get your stuff out. Right. He set up to get his belongings out. Right. And while doing so, well, before the person was able to come and grab his belongings, his belongings were taken from his apartment. Right. Okay. There is surveillance footage that does show every maintenance personnel on this property entering that apartment and leaving with something. So I'm going to start with you from the basic. Wow. You know, did you enter the apartment? I'm saying uh, it's procedure. Okay, what's you the know, procedure? You know, to go in there, you know, uh, trash out, you know, uh, you know, no. do maintenance requests and, no. okay. you know, stuff like Was that. Was there a maintenance request? No, I'm saying. Uh, well, you know, it was a main request, you know, to change the lock or whatever at the time. Okay. And, you know, it was a uh, main request, you know, to go out there and, uh, you know, see what was going on out there, you know, for us trashing out process and stuff like that. Okay, I got you. So, was that it? Just a maintenance request for the, the change of the locks and to the, and the check the condition of the unit? Right. Was there anything that was requested to take the items from the unit? No. Nah. Okay. Did you take any items from the unit? No. Nah. You sure? Yeah, I think I nah. got a whole new maintenance crew. Nah, you didn't, or nah, you're not no, sure? No, sir, I did not. Okay. All right. So, it, you on camera? I'm quite sure I'm here. You know what I'm saying? You but, know? but but taking stuff? I don't, I don't see how that can be possible. Because I don't got nothing in my possession said that I took anything, Officer Black. I, I didn't say you still got it in your possession. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, I'm, just I'm saying, asking if you took it. video proof no, doing it, bro. You know what I'm saying? Saying nah. that I took something? Yeah. I'm asking. No, I ain't took nothing. Okay. All right. So other, so the only reason why you went into the unit was to change the locks and to check the status of the, the unit to see right. what the condition of the unit right. was. Right. Okay. And there was no order for anything to be removed from the apartment. You no. didn't take anything. No, sir. Okay. You have your ID on you by chance? Yes, sir, I do. Perfect. All right. Thank All you. Right. There's a lot of parts they messed up at, and the first part they messed up at is doing it, doing it with that dude who snitched off rap, like the first dude. That was a law-abiding citizen. He was not ready to do no stealing, and they definitely set him up. But they set him up, and he was not going. He snitching on everything. He said that it was three dudes with him, you and other dude, and we got y'all on video. That's the second part y'all messed up at, and y'all just cooked. And at least one dude admitted everything and just started snitching. At least one dude. He was a law abiding citizen, man. He had to feed his family. Despite their justifications, the officer informed the victim he had located his bedroom set. However, the victim refused to take them back and wanted to press charges against all three individuals. Yeah. I don't want that. I probably got that one. So I got some good news, some bad news, some news. What's, what's the good news? Good what's news. The bad, news? The bad news is I'm getting three different conflicting stories. Of course, yeah. Yeah, to it's be okay. expected. Okay. Good news, I found your bedroom set, your sofa, and your two nightstands. If you want them back. I don't want them back. Or if you want to sell them. That was the offer that I was proposed to me to offer to you. The only thing I could do is tell somebody, no. hey, I'll, I'll let them know, but it's going to be up to him. I paid for a U-Haul truck that was sitting for two days. That's money I lost. Yeah. Look, I, you I don't, don't got to take it. Yeah, I, I just, I'm a man of my words. So if you say, hey, tell them this and this, I'm going to tell them, and then it'll be up to them. Yeah. Um, but I'm getting conflicting stories. You want arrest him, you want arrest him, yeah. I do have, the only thing that I do have is the amendments of each party entering into your unit. I don't care about that. We got to um, be able to this thing. Right. So, I'm going to make some calls to CID, 
see how we want to go and proceed from here. As far as do they want to re-question them or if I have enough right now to just take in everybody. Um, as far as I know right now, you're good. If you want to hang out, you can. I'm going to hang out because and I want to press charges. I'm not yeah, going to I, I, I got you. I got you. I got you. Like I said, I'm just presenting you what I got right now. Yes, sir. That's it. Just the facts I was able to gather. Okay. Um, and we're going to go from there. So let me call CID, see what their input is, and then we'll do what we got to do. I hear you. After consulting with the supervisor, the officer decided to arrest the maintenance crew. Um, I'm about to put three into custody. Just want to give you a heads up. Okay, thank you. They even have one, bro. Yeah. Let's do this. Let's, um, don't bring the van all the way in. Because it's the maintenance workers, and I don't want them to, uh, learn each other kind of get spooked out because yeah you want me to meet you there yeah yeah yeah. i'll meet you at the church and then we'll come up to the front office and then i'll have that lady call all the maintenance men back to the front office and then we'll do what we got to do there so yeah i'll meet you at the church across the street all right perfect all right. one by one the crew members were called into the leasing office and apprehended. Hello. I'm back again. This is my regional manager. Hi, Hi, I'm doing well. How about yourself? Nice Might not want to trust you, Yeah. We'll do that. Um, can we get all three to this office one at a time? Please. Do you care who goes first? You take your pick. Okay. Go with the dude who's snitching. He a nice dude, man. He will get out the way. In case somebody goes to jail well, like, today, can I no, have no. them take off their gray star uniforms so that they don't have mug shots with our company name on them? We can make that request. It just depends on how compliant they want to be because they are. are well, damn. Okay. Oh. Hey, yo, she disowning them already? Yo, she's strictly business. I like that. I knew about the way you were sitting on that desk. I knew it was something about you. I ain't even gonna lie. In case somebody goes to jail today, can I have them take off their gray star uniforms? She just so owned it, them boys. Damn. Damn. Company name on them? <laughs> we can make that request. It just depends on how compliant they want to be because they are. No, are, are sir. Jail today. Okay. You cannot okay. represent us. Okay. Um, uh, Don't let them know that. No, 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 no. Oh, no. Uh, it, if and when you notify them that they're going to be arrested, can we'll request at that time. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. Thank you. Yep. Thank you very much. Not a problem. Um, we we want to somehow get the resident's belongings back to him. Okay. You know, um. So I know where. Because I, I his personally bed. just spoke with all of them, and they did. <laughs> oh, they did. Confess. I I know where his bed. Because so as an far. employer, I had to open up that dialogue because we need to take action on our end as well. Yeah. So, um... I know as far as his bed and sofa goes, you don't he's like, I don't want that back. Because, okay. you know... That's okay. probably got bed bugs. Bed and sofa. Right. right. Um, I think the big thing that he's the really bugs. looking for okay. is his bed MacBook. Don't bite okay. I know. Oh, which... Okay. okay. Is MIA right now. Nice. Only one person confessed to me Mm -hmm. And what they took. Gotcha. And so the stuff that they took, stuff that he doesn't really want back, but his MacBook right now. Yeah. And so he's working on actually logging into his Apple ID. Yeah. And tracking it. Do they yeah. have because a ring camera had been mentioned? Mm -hmm. Do they have the video of who walked out with certain mm -hmm. items? It's just okay. it was in a bag, and so it's oh, hard to say okay. Okay. who had the bag. Yeah. But what no, day it was? You see, Claire's Day mattress. Yeah. Uh, I'm trying TV. To order some yeah. Everything. Yeah. And David is coming. Okay. And what I'll actually do too is I'll give you my business card with the case number on Please. it. And I'll give you my business card as well. That way, if you have any questions. Perfect. Damn, I have to do that a minute too.
Why? It's the snitch for I knew it. I knew it. It was a stand-up law-abiding right? citizen, man. Yes, sir. So they're requesting that we take this shirt off. Do you have a shirt on underneath? I need to go change. I just got a tank top. Can I just go? Nah, you ain't got to worry about it. Yeah, forget about it. Palms together. Nobody cares about your brand, son. Can I ask why I'm arrested? Yes, sir. Just give me one second, I'm going to tell you exactly why. Am I the only one being arrested? No, sir. Right now, you're being placed under arrest. See, that's his problem. He ran about the other people. I'm the only one going to get arrested. For burglary. Sorry, did you say that again? You're always being nosy. Yes, sir. Can I talk to the guy? This is strange to me that it wasn't my fault. I've done that, but he's past that point right now. He came home and all his stuff was gone. All right, do you have anything on you I need to know about? Weapons, knives? No. Okay. Airboat. You got keys to every house out right. there. Do me a favor. That's the scary part. I mean, this man have a key to your house at all times. And just... Unless, you know... You can stand your house owner. Hold on. <laughs> yep. Huh? Thank you, sir. That's a nice apartment. God damn it. Hey, but the pool was good. Not for so a he... apartment. I'm so sorry. Mm -hmm. No, you're fine. Are you putting in the incident report? That the resident only wants a natural back? Um, I can't. And yeah. I'll confirm with him okay. about what property he really wants to get back. Yeah. I know the big thing that he mentioned when we were there was his MacBook. I can ask him. Yeah, yeah. Well, we would love. Mm -hmm. we want Once we get, great, you know, all this, bigger and then. Because um, he's still outside. Okay. okay. And so I'll let him. Okay. He's, he's been level headed. Given yeah, the circumstances, yeah, I, I, um, so agree. yeah, I'll I'll send him in and then you guys can talk and try to make it right, however best we can. Yeah, oh, sounds right. good. Let me get five months free. You said call the next one. I need five months free. You know what I'm saying? Pay rent, five months free. I get to chill in my house, laid back, five months free, electric free, gas free, water free, freaking everything free. You know what I'm saying? For the next four months, that's what I'm thinking, Maxwell. Make it right. If you want me to make it right. He's on his way. He didn't answer my phone calls. Yeah, I see him over there. All right. Give me a favor. Put James on you back. Yes, sir. Do you have a shirt on underneath? Yeah, let me take it off. All right, go ahead. Yeah, Rolex, you got to go too, buddy. Palms together. Thank you, sir. Other dude was the hood dude. Hold on. He ain't gonna go for it. Other right, right brother was like, nah, right, right. I ain't going. Ooh. Do you have a shirt on underneath? Ooh. You don't have a shirt on underneath? Ooh. All right. You can just palms together. I'll let you handle that. But I need you. Rotate. No, oh, this way. There you go. Okay, we are resting the culprit. Rotate your hand. There you go. I'm trying not to pinch you, bro, but you. There you go. Look. Step over here. We'll get to that. I got you. 
somebody for them if they want me to. Sure. Do you guys want me to call me better? Uh, my wife. I have to leave it He got a wife and everything. That's what I'm saying. He's a law abiding citizen. He said his wife. He just had to go back to his Even kid. in handcuffs, they pleaded with the officer. They asked him to speak with the victim, hoping to find a way out of arrest. What's that? That's me. I gotta confirm. I think it's a felony though. What? Burglary. Salute. I don't have my phone. Man, it's in the car. Doing the middle, we've been there before. The victim wants to, not me. I, I, did, I did talk to him. I did. And he is too. I know, but we couldn't talk to him. What? They said we couldn't talk to him. I'm trying to get everything rectified. Okay, so, so we'll do this. My partner left to go get the van. Once he get back here, I'll go talk with the victim because he's still here, right. and and we'll, we'll go from there. Sure. All right. I got you. I I got my I'm not doing that. People were adamant, like he really, because I mean, you got think you, you came middle with the head man, right? How did you feel? Who y'all think with the head man in the situation, chat? Who do y'all think facilitated everything? You know what I'm saying? I feel like he just the strength. He's the brain. And he's the, like he, in his own words, the follower. You know? Is that right? Let me know if you I, I ain't seen, but I don't keep up with all the residents. No, no, I'm talking about your personal house. You came home all your stuff gone. You'd be mad. Yeah, but it's not the right kind of situation. Yeah. Right. But like I said, if that wasn't offered earlier, you know what I'm saying? When I spoke to everybody individually, nobody said, hey, let me talk to him. Let me try to. Yeah, yeah, yeah he you did. And but the thing was, you offered his bag. You don't he, want his bag back. It's already been gone to somebody else's house. To, uh, talk to the dude. So uh, we can rectify. Give me some. Give me some. Man. Just let him get his stuff back. Right. I I can only do one thing at a time. Yeah, bro, you I'm might saying. got bad, bro. Just let him get his stuff back. Right. I I can only do one thing at a time. I'm gonna sit right here. All right. Got you. And then we go from there. Right, that would be good because we get this stuff back with you, you know, in the prisons. So nothing, you know, I'll break out. Be quiet. You want headphones? Just make sure. I know. Okay. Hmm? It's, it's, it's on him. He the victim. Right. I can't do no moves without the victim's can victim work. Well, so you can't bring him in so we can talk to him. I can't bring him in here, no, I can't do that. But I can go talk to him. Yeah. Right. I can't I can't just leave out in here well, cover. <laughs> no, man, it's liability, man. It's, well, it's, it's, I, can't, I can't I can't <laughs> Nah that way. It don't work that way. All right, Jay, I'm trying to get you to catch before he leaves. He not, oh, he not leaving. No, nah, he's waiting for y'all. Right. He, he, look, he, if, he, if he, y'all he get him, he's going to spend on y'all for an hour, 30 something. I was just not over here dope for him. He didn't need that time. True. And he got down and put somebody out illegally. And he had me in some shit. So. I know. Again. I, I, Talk to him. I got you. Right now. I got you. I don't got no more straps for, um, I can't get no more feelings. Like, my real clean. I ain't no more first offender. Right. They're telling me you're trying to say our name and stuff, man. You're telling me. Right. You're telling me, look, man, we're going to get your stuff back. I got family. Why should you be in the prison? I got you. So, when you tell you, you break out. Don't let the uniform fool you. I'm quick. I believe you will. I'm quick to be a big man. You quick, but I bet you I'm quick. 
you are. You ain't quicker than this. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, can I get a uh, number four? No tomatoes. You heard me? Yeah, number four, no tomatoes. That's the uh, that's the the fries with it, right? No, no. Can I get the meal? Oh. Yeah, I want the I want the fries with it. I want the Philly cheese steak and the fries with the soda. I forgot what number that is. Yeah, no tomatoes though. You got it? I appreciate it. Going off the leash off. The leash off. The leash. Man, I be forgetting the numbers, bro. Back. Hey, yo, chat. I, bro, look. My story is, if you don't know the number of the food that's on the wall when you call, they gonna finesse you off your bread. They gonna put the f food way higher than it's supposed to be. But you gotta respect the hustle and you gotta respect the grind because if you know, you know, it's like a local spot, so you gotta know. You better call before. You better you better know your numbers. I learned the first thing, bro. I've been, I've been doing this for some time. I started young, man. I started doing this when I was real young. Yeah, I was gonna be law enforcement when I was 19 at first, and I was young, but. Yo, yeah, just tell that man that, but I still ain't gonna. I got you. you, know what I'm saying? you know, I got you. Know look, look. I wasn't presented this earlier. When I asked, when I talked to everybody individually, certain things were offered to be returned. But who, I, let me finish. But who want a bed back after somebody, another man, has slept in it? Man, he ain't slept in a bed for five months. You know, it, it, but I'm saying, I offered. I said, hey, look, I got this and this found. So he going to help me All right. All right, Just stand by real quick. Nah, he I'll, be I'll be right back. Bro, we are late. Yeah, mouth is moving. They're walking. Bro, don't want nothing back. This report was going to take about three to five days. Okay. And then, you want to go. The officer informed the victim of the cruise. Can you see litigation? Yeah. What you mean? Like a lawyer? It's a, like a civil suit? Yeah. I can. Yeah. What, what did I do to do that? Uh, you will contact a lawyer? Mm -hmm. um, a civil lawyer or a criminal one if you want to go through the criminal courts to do it explain the situation um, give them a copy of the police report which is going to take about three to five days okay. and then they'll read the report they'll go over the facts with you and then y'all go from there how do I get the report? Um, on my business card? Mm -hmm. go ahead Tempor. Um, you see the front? This is, so the police department, you can go there, give them that case number, they can give you a copy of it. Or if you call that number, the front desk, I believe that they were emailing them during COVID, I think they might still be. Okay. But I'm not 100% sure. Okay. So I've been sent out here, try to talk to you by the gentleman inside, mm -hmm. by the maintenance crew. Mm -hmm. they, they want me to plead their case for you, to, for them, to you, Same about, I listen, I, I know, but I'm a man of my word. Like the same same way, okay. you know what I'm saying? Vice versa. Yeah, hey, I don't um, care about none of that. They said they can get your stuff back. They'll give you your stuff back, but try to see if there's anything you'd be willing to do for them not to get arrested today. Sound good. I'm a man of my word. What did I, I remember I told you that earlier, right? Yeah. If they ask me something, I, pre I present it to them. Same way if you say, hey, look, just tell them I get my, my stuff back. Um, You know, that's it. But, it's an invasion of privacy, no, it's total disrespect. I don't expect yeah. you to take it. And I'm not telling you what to do. I'm just saying, they asked me to do it. I understand. I'm going to do it. Um, also, too, the regional manager's inside. 
she wants to know if you wanted to talk to them about anything or yeah, I do. okay um, this process, I'll talk to them. Uh, perfect Thank see you. we're catching on Thank you. yeah when they outside i'll talk to them okay and he parked right there he wanted to see them going there y'all think he's gonna be outside the car yeah Appreciate it. He's not hearing me. Yeah. He not. No. Why not? Feel like he was violated. That's what he said. It was an invasion of his privacy. Mm -hmm. All right. Mm -hmm. Is he still at? Where are you Yeah, he will be in certain ways.